hello and welcome to the channel hope you are doing well in today's video we are going to learn about extensions in swift extension is a powerful mechanism provided in swift language that allows the developer to add more functionality to already built classes for example we can add our own function to existing string class ui view class and other classes in order to create extensions we have to use the keyword extension as you see here extension then the class name to which we want to add the functionality that is our own functionality for example in this case we've been going to add and extend this functionality to string class so we will write the class name here then curly braces open and then curly braces close so this is the syntax to write an extension in Swift. in this tutorial we are going to write the function to check whether the email is valid or not inside our extension and and we are going to extend that function to our string class so here you can see from line number three we write the function is valid email that accept email id as a parameter so we are going to use the same function inside the extension class for the string so here we will copy this function command x and delete it and then we write this function inside our string extension block and here we will not accept any parameter because this is a this is a string class extension and so every object will be a string so here we will replace email id with self that is the string itself so here this is the way we can write a function to the string class using extension so this is we are done with adding is valid email function to the string class using extension now let's see how to use it so we will create where email id is equals to apc at rate test dot com and now let's say print is email valid is equals to and here we will pass email id so here this is our string object so here we will place dot and now you can see is valid email is already added as a method to our string class so let's say is valid email here and here so now let's see and here you can say is valid email is equals to true and now if i change this email id and then you can see this email id is false so this is not a correct email id now i again put the at red mark in our email id and run the code and here you can see it's the valid email so here we created is valid email method or we added this is valid email method to our string class using extension and then we use it so here this is a small tutorial where you learned how to use extension in swift and how we can create extensions in string and then we use it in our code if you like this tutorial then please give it a thumbs up and do share this video if you haven't subscribed to our channel then please subscribe it as we are going to bring more videos on swift language in coming time lastly thanks for watching have a nice time bye for now